Okay, just really quick, wanted to show the problems this radio is having before I even pop the cover on it. Sitting on top right now, basically just a bare bones stock radio. Only thing that's ever been done to this is it has variable power. And what I want to show is on the spectrum analyzer here. This is the this radio here is currently hooked up to the spectrum analyzer. Goes uh, through this coax cable to a big 500 watt. 30 dB attenuator on the floor, comes back up through the back side of the bench, comes through here, goes through another 20 dB attenuator, so the reference offset's already set to 50 dB, so, but this is what you should see when you key the microphone. Key the microphone, basically one spur. The span is set right now um, from start frequency so the left side of the screen is 20 megahertz and the right side of the screen is 35 megahertz so the only thing you should see when you key up the microphone is the frequency you're talking on which is what's what's happening there so that's a proper working radio so let's disconnect the coax from a proper working radio go down here to the problem child this one off. Microphone in. So there, it's set to AM. And key the microphone. Hmm, lots of spurs. And this is a multi-band radio. So what I'm going to do is, is flip through the bands, and you can see the spurs. It's horrible. So we'll start on A. Look at all that energy that's. I mean, in some cases that's down only, what, 10, 20, maybe 30 dB. Um, there's B band, C, D, which is the CB band, E, and F. And on every band, it's got all this extra energy. Wait, I'm, <laughs> I'm not sure. At first, when I first saw it, I thought... It, problem in the oscillator circuit but bam I'm really gonna have to pop the cover on this one and take a look at this is this is really a weird problem um, it's not like it's a I mean if it was a second harmonic you know on band D which is right here that would be in the 54 megahertz band there should be a you know so actually let me move the uh, stop frequency so let's say 60 megahertz so the right side of the screen now represents 60 megahertz so as you can see there's actually no spur down at 54 megahertz uh, which is what you want all of the extra energy it's it's just really weird i just wanted to document this before i even open this radio up to see what's wrong with it and then i'll update the the video later after i get it figured out and get it fixed